X Sports Report 10 Hag is to Man United what Southgate has been to England, a seemingly underwhelming boss sweeping away C. The Cristiano Ronaldo circus has left town, the bitter civil war with the Glazers is ending and Eric Ten Hag grows in authority by the day. Its most famous club, Manchester United, are threatening to sweep away a decade of confusion and despair. Pep Guardiola, so often ahead of his time, blurted it out not long before the World Cup break. And Christian Eriksen is a masterstroke free transfer who could have a similar impact to Teddy Sheringham, another supreme craftsman who arrived at United when he was the wrong side of 30. Marcus Rashford has been revived, the 18-year-old Alejandro Garnacho is a thrilling prospect and a January move for Dutch striker Cody Gakpo is a tantalizing possibility with United perhaps only a centre-forward short of becoming an elite team again. United have beaten Liverpool, Arsenal and Tottenham and have drawn at Chelsea under Ten Hag. Steve Wilson, the BBC commentator who should be the heir to John Motson and Barry Davis but somehow never receives due credit, came out with the best line I've heard this tournament during the France v Morocco semi-final. With the vast Moroccan support creating an almighty din, Wilson stated that, unlike most games of this World Cup, the match was being played in front of a crowd not an audience.